Auzubillahi minasyaitonirrajim. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My dear students, I am from Bayes Higher Secondary School Sogam. Subject Education Class 12th. And our today's topic is various types of learning. My dear students, as you know that we are today reading the lesson 9 and that is learning. And our today's topic is that is various types of learning. Dear students, there are various types of activities. Learning depends upon the nature of activities. Every person in this world has varied interests. Hence, he may indulge more in those activities in which he is interested. However, some of the important stages or types of learning during our lifetime are given as under. Number one, motor learning. Dear students, Motor learning means any change in the physical behavior pattern of an individual when the child is young and his mental capacities are not so developed. He learns the motor activity such as eye-hand coordination, walking, talking, running, jumping, writing, holding of an object, and control of muscles, etc. These all are known as motor learning. Acquisition of all skills is a part of motor learning. In fact, motor learning is a sort of imitation learning. Now, number second, perceptual learning. Dear students, when the mind of a child develops, he gets sensations through the different sense organs and gives meaning to them. Every person has sense organs like sense of sight, sense of smell, sense of touch, etc. These organs play important role in perceptions in life. The ability to discriminate the tastes, colors, sound and smells is acquired through perceptions. Perception is a mental apprehension of what is seen, heard, or what is felt. Thus, this type of learning is also based on past experiences of the person. Now, number third, it is verbal learning, number fourth, conceptual learning, and number five, associative learning. We will discuss them in next class. Thank you very much.